Yo, Mutthead TV, what is going on? It's Popular Stranger, and I am back today with another video for you. Today we're going to be doing a review of the card that you see in front of you. It's the 99 overall team MVP, LaShawn McCoy from the Philadelphia Eagles. And this is my favorite team, my favorite player in the NFL, so every limited edition or better card that LaShawn McCoy has had this year in Madden 25... I've had it, so I had the 93 overall limited edition when they dropped the midseason Football Outsiders 97 overall. I got that one, and I had to do the collection when this one dropped to get this card, and it's been well, well worth it. So I thought I'd share it with you guys. I know it's a card that's not easy to get, um, and if you're kind of on the fence of getting it, if you're trying to make a decision, you know, should I get LaShawn McCoy or should I get Adrian Peterson? Maybe I can be here, be here to persuade you to get this card. Again, I think it's really, really worth it. Looking at the stats on the back, it gives you a plus 8 to long pass and plus 13 to speed run if you do worry about your chemistry. And the other really cool thing about it is that it gives your whole team a plus 2 to agility, which is really important in my opinion. And I've definitely noticed a difference since I've had this card as well. Um, back of the stats, or back of the card stats, 97 acceleration. 76 trucking, 96 speed, 95 awareness, 99 elusiveness, 98 agility, 95 carry, 97 ball carrier vision. Um, as I said, I've had the other versions of this card. The And I'll, I'll get in, we're going to get into some gameplay here in a moment. I'll get into the differences that I've seen um, from the other versions to this version. If maybe you're looking to get one of the cheaper uh, versions that aren't highly as rated um, Maybe I can give you some insight on that maybe persuade you to get one of those cards if those are more in your budget So here's the card um, I'm not really gonna get into the hidden stats on the screen, but I will talk about some of them So let's get into some gameplay All right, so the biggest thing that I've noticed from the other cards to this card uh, or is his ability to truck and break off of tackles um, he's always been a very fast running back as you see he's gonna break away from the crowd right here uh, the original 93 version 93 speed the 97 version had a 95 speed this one a 96 so not a huge difference in and he always makes people miss with the jukes and the you know if you tap your analog stick you're gonna make people miss with every version of the card but the biggest difference like I said is he breaks off a lot more tackles he falls forward a lot more and you know I've never had the pleasure of being able to play play with any of the Adrian Peterson cards but it's almost like he's a another version of Adrian Peterson uh, but the biggest difference between him and AP in, in my opinion is that he catches the ball a whole lot better he has an 85 catch rating I think AP's is in the lower 70s or maybe even 60s um, so you can run screen plays with him you can run you know wheel routes with him and he's gonna catch the ball he has a decent catch and traffic rating like a 71 um, his route running is a 79 so he does find ways to get open as a halfback and then once he gets the ball I mean it's just one juke and you pretty much are making people miss as he shoves off a tackler there and that's something even when he's in the trenches that I've noticed that happens a lot and it's just it, it's really good and, th and that's why I think this card is better than the Adrian Peterson any Adrian Peterson card in this game um, now to be honest that's only th that's the main difference that I've noticed is the breaking of tackles so if you're looking for a speed back a guy who can just get out in space and you can't really afford this 99 overall card you definitely could go with the 97 or 93 versions. If you look on the weekends, you can probably get the 93 overall for 40 to 50K and the uh, 97 overall for probably under 100K. And I, and I think those are definitely worth it. Um, again, me being a huge Eagles fan, uh, I had to go out and get this, this better card and the, the plus two agility. I've definitely noticed the difference, but you see there he catches the pass out of the backfield, makes a juke move, then breaks off a tackler. So that just throw, shows all three of the good things that he can do in one singular play there. He's going to fall forward on a goal line type run, um, and then there he just shoves off another tackler. That's something that the previous versions, again, do not do, but this one does one tap of that juke stick and he's usually making at least one defender miss and then he's just going to shove off another tackler there 
rolling to the end zone. So I hope you guys enjoyed the review. If you have any questions about the card, be sure to hit me up in the comments. You can also go to Mutthead dot com search the player card and look in the comment section on there and that goes for any player card in the game check out butthead.com for other people's opinions on the card it's a popular stranger peace